I've made some progress on my 3D laser scanner project that I want to show today. What you're looking at here is a motorized platform. There's a stepper motor that turns to the round part. Uh, I have a disassembled webcam pointed at it. I had to open it up because I had to add an external trigger to tell it when to take pictures. I'm controlling the system with a stepper motor controller, the kind you can easily find on eBay. In this case, it's a three-axis controller. And I am powering the line laser externally. I tried changing the voltage to change the intensity of the light. That was very sensitive since it's a diode. And so instead, I'm running at full voltage and attenuating the light with an old uh, polarizer from when I watched a 3D movie. I just cross-polarized the laser light to attenuate it somewhat. And um, I'm actually running Windows 7, 64-bit. So it was a little tricky to figure this out. I'm running a Python script that uh, talks to the parallel port. And all I really have to do is enable the motor, pick the direction, and then strobe the step pin on and off to get it to move. And so I wrote a little script that takes a few steps and then triggers the relay on the stepper motor controller which tells the Logitech webcam program to take a picture and I repeat that process until the object has completely rotated and I save all those images. I actually turn the lights off when I do it uh, but for the demo video here I'll leave the lights on just to show it working and so I have my little DOS window open. I will post the uh, Python script and talk about how to make that work with Windows 7 64-bit. That was kind of a trick. So I'm going to run the program here for you. Here we go. So the pictures are being taken and the object is being rotated. You can see I had to stick the elephant down to the platform because it moved sort of abruptly and it was making it uh, sort of crawl around on the platform. That's something I'll have to work out. You can also see that I'm really going to need to use two line lasers, one pointing from the left and one pointing from the right because as the elephant rotates there are times when the camera can't even see the laser line but uh, just within a few seconds there you can see it did a full rotation and saved the images of all those lines my next step is to process the lines so that I can build up a point cloud and from the point cloud I'm going to build a mesh but this is all completely homemade stuff and I'm learning a lot in the process so updates on the way